Welcome one and all to Can't Draw Horses Club. The club where we can't draw horses. Huh? Uh, yeah. Today I'm joined by Az. And I'm definitely not being held hostage right now. Yeah, yeah I see the message you've tried to, tried to send to the... <laughs> your, your cry for help. Let's say. Uh. Hey, I should. I need to adjust your desktop. It's 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 way wrong. What the heck is going on here? Why is it like this? <laughs> Let me reset that. Huh? No. Okay. It's. Uh, Why doesn't it like you? No. It. It. Okay. You might not be able to hear me for a moment. Okay. I mean, they, them, the, the chat. Oh, okay. So I can still hear you. Anyways. Man, you were saying really mean things about chat just then. Everyone say goodbye to our guest. What? No! <laughs> it was wonderful to have you. You can't get rid of me. No narcs in the club. Snitches get kicked off the stream. Ah. <laughs> uh... <laughs> good, good. Would a narc do that? <laughs> I, huh? You can give me all the money you want. It's not gonna. <laughs> it's not changing facts. <laughs> Pretty sure I had a plan for how to start the stream, explaining oh, we're gonna be drawing today. We're drawing leaves. You leaves. You wanted to tree things. You wanted to have a so plan. So vascular. Uh, this is loading, ready, run. Happy Labor Day everybody i'm doing two streams today because there are no holidays on twitch uh everything we do is brought to you by you through patreon patreon.com forward slash loading ready run you can buy stuff at store.com or as it's usually known store store.loadingreadyrun.com it's dot com and is it yeah, what you talk else? about the store. Where are you going? Nowhere. What are you doing to that baby? I say hi to chat. He says no. He says I don't want to say hi to chat. No, you want to say hi to chat. Yeah, we want. Yeah, look at that boy. Look at this boy. That cat's younger than my primary mouse. Uh huh. I have, uh, I'm using a replacement mouse at the moment. I haven't, I haven't cleaned the, the gunk out of, out of my, my no, normal, she... my mouse. He's like, mother, this is uncomfortable. That poor old man. Yeah. <laughs> See, this is what he gets for meowing at me. Yep. Let's put him back in his box. He left his box. Yeah, well, he can go back. Well, let's see if he stays. Oh, yeah. Thanks, bud. Uh, yes. Okay. So, drawing leaps. Uh, as has 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 collected many many photo refs. Whoops. Uh huh. Reliefs. I can go back away. No. Oh God! <laughs> my my secrets. No. Oh, you ruined it. Uh, OBS was complaining at me before the stream, so I had to figure out how to uninstall plugins, which is navigate to one of their subfolders in the program files and delete some DLLs. <laughs> Fantastic system. 
Uh, right. Before stream, my grandmother sent me a text. Oh, no. Uh, uh... <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah. That's some good growth. It is. Look at how tiny the pot is versus... I'm amazed that plants can sustain that height in that small of a pot. Just... <laughs> Sheesh. Yeah. I think... I, I remember my mom saying that they got some, like, volunteer sunflowers or something like that. <laughs> uh... Turns out. It's been, Turns out. It's been a summer. Anyways, uh, I haven't really done any of my warm-ups other than trying to draw a leaf. I was trying to draw um, the uh, Animal Crossing. Yes. No. Nook no. Leaf. No. 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 <laughs> if memory. that's the Nook Leaf, I'm leaving. If that is the Nook Leaf, I am leaving this stream. Without reference this is like trying pokemon from memory what's the last time you saw a pokemon hold on you hold draw on. you draw an oddish right now okay hold on it's a round head and round body and tiny arms and bee eyes and it's got like spikes i think uh and then there's like a shell Probably, and oddish. I don't know. Oh, oddish. I thought you said something else. <laughs> what did you Wait, think oddish. I said? Oddish. Uh. Oh, Done. Oh. Oh wow. I should probably turn the stabilization down on this pen. <laughs> oh, that's your problem. <laughs> also, I'm just gonna put this out there. Uh. Animal Crossing leaf. Are you sure it doesn't have like one line? You sure it? It's one line. I mean, I kind of did mine in one line, but it was very thin, so I had to go back to <laughs> the bucket and fill it. And I, I fully enclosed the shape. You'll see. So it didn't even fill my whole, my whole canvas. Uh, I guess I should take the, uh, the, uh, the, the, the progress where I can get it. Yeah, huh? and then I put these helpful highlights in. So you can see that it's a leaf and not like <laughs> a tear in space to, to the green zone. <laughs> oh, this is starting off strong, baby. <laughs> yeah, maybe we'll just look at your screen for a while while I <laughs> continue my warm up. I'll just delete this. It's fine. It's fine. I don't need like constructive feedback or anything. What? No, it's a beautiful leaf. Uh, positive reinforcement. Uh, I thought you were going for a maple leaf. Honestly, I thought you were going to be like, I was going. I was trying to do the 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 leaf from the Canadian flag. But why would green. I make it upside down and green? I don't know. That makes as much sense as it being the Animal Crossing leaf. Yes, evil bad man. Anytime, any place. Hit me up with those PowerPoints. <laughs> <laughs> oh gosh. I would be the I championing of drawing. Let's see, what do maple leaves look like? Got a thingy, and then they kind of go in, and then there's a branchy thing, spiky, and then they go out, out and then they go in, go up, and then they go and down, around the corner, and then the bunny goes into its hole, hole, yeah. And <laughs> there we go. Boom. Beautiful. One maple leaf. <laughs> oh. 
to Emily's been posting some good pictures in chat today. Oh, doing good work. Ooh, that's pretty. That would be a really good painting. The the tree that's transitioning down. Well, too bad you brought your own your own leaves to the party. Uh, my favorite is this one plant that is repeating in a lot of my photos and that's because <laughs> hold on which one oh it's tiny yeah i have to oh with the yeah. like spear leaves yeah so this one this one is entertaining because i actually have i couldn't find all of them but I have multiple pictures of this plant because <laughs> it's the it's the plant that goes alongside my uh, my go to Starbucks, <laughs> and so I get to watch the plant grow as I go to Starbucks throughout the year, <laughs> and I'll take pictures of it. <laughs> I think it looks pretty. <laughs> So I'll just be chilling in the drive-thru, waiting to get up to the window. I'll be like, oh, the plants look really nice today. So, like, you're not even out there touching grass. <laughs> oh, God, no. <laughs> you uh... somehow... In in your nature photography, completely evaded nature. <laughs> More or less. <laughs> Sitting there with your frappuccino and your oh. air conditioning. <laughs> it is a pretty plant though I don't even know if I can continue <laughs> you're the one who invited me <laughs> you chose me for your first time back after a month off yeah that's how much you like me mm. so sorry what was this about wanting you just want to end now uh I mean, I've got a lot of time to kill before ice cream. Oh, okay. Yeah, that makes sense. You yeah. may as well draw some plants while you're at it. Yeah. I mean, I could I could go take some pictures of some trees out, outside. Uh, you could. Come, we can we can postpone this. Uh, no, until, no, no. Until I go outside one time. No. <laughs> you wait. You go outside. What in the future? In the future, I plan uh, to go outside. We're streaming outdoors for some reason. You know, that it's for work. Like a, yeah, yeah. Well, you get ice cream out of it, right? That's what they tell me. Man, now I want to have ice cream. I'll just get in your car. <laughs> I don't live in Victoria. I don't get to exist without a car. I'm they don't sucked. have ice cream in your country they do but i do have to use a car to go get it mm -hmm. or pay somebody else to use a car to go get it uh-huh <laughs> uh. is this what y'all signed up for i hope so <laughs> it's what they're getting this is what you're getting yeah <laughs> Yeah, he just volunteered to get you, you ice cream. Yeah, but he wants me to pay him. I think, is that what... Or... But how would I... I don't know how to pay him when I'd be paying him with this. Just throw, like, a handful of ones at him. Ooh, that's a good idea. I don't have any ones, but I do have a good chunk of change somewhere. That's, I could just That's toss. enough for some ice cream. Just throw a bunch of pennies at it. 
Get me ice cream! <laughs> now I'm doing a cool graffiti effect on my, my maple Ooh, leaf. Graffiti effect. Yeah. You highlight with a, a brighter color line. I know. Yeah. Oh, you know? But, you were going to say no, you know? no, no, clearly you're teaching me a concept for the first time, Corey. Look at how much better that looks now. <laughs> I just had this idea and then I executed on it. Isn't art lovely? <laughs> you can just make stuff. And no one can stop you. God. I'm just going to keep going. This Why do I great. do Why do I do this to myself? Oh, let's do another color. Yeah, going around the bend again. Start with the stem. Yes. Oh, lovely. Wait, 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 wait. wait. No. Bailo says there's a thing called Control Z. I don't know what he's. I don't know what they're talking about. Sorry. Isn't that a web comic? Oh, is that what that is? Okay. Yeah, I think so. Like an old one, like a really old one. When people had to make uh, comics, key keyboard on references on their on their comics. <laughs> oh, Beowulf. If I had the this, ability like, to put you in timeout for that joke, I would. Future Olympic logos. I, I if see I go what to you Canada did. Again. Winter Olympics. <laughs> they sell this at the bay. Technically, Corey started it. I just went along with the I'm ride. I'm just doing my work here. I suddenly feel like I have too much power. Yeah. Thanks, mods. <laughs> you should try and fulfill that dark fantasy. Thank you. Just a <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh. You know, it's it's, oh, no. it's honestly unfortunate that the YouTube audience won't see any of this. I know, right? All they have is they, my leaf. They have to live in misery. My and, beautiful and, and... Canada leaf. Are you just going to keep getting lighter and lighter with your lines until you think it looks pretty? No. <laughs> Ah, uh, I definitely don't know, Corey. Not at all. I'm pretty sure I stated that was my mission. <laughs> Fair. I think I said that out loud. Bam! Beautiful. You know, if you, you saw know this on the side of a building, you wouldn't complain. You know, it's really the shaky lines that sell it. You think I should turn stabilization on? <laughs> no! That's for winners. What do you mean winners? <laughs> All right, I'm going to control Z, which is a thing I've just learned about, uh, and do that last line again. <laughs> Whoops. Oh, no. Oh, God. I don't know if I like this one as much anymore. I think I liked it more the first time I did it. Oh, oh that's the worst when you undo a line and then redo it yeah. and it's actually... Well, now you're just doing it intentionally. Well, I figured it was a lost cause. So. You may as well just finish I mean, it out. No, just... Rather rather than no. stopping your line where it was, you would rather continue the line before I'm doing it. You gotta do the it. whole thing. <laughs> you gotta... Have you ever heard of this thing? It's called lifting your pen up from the screen. No, a, a great artist once showed me drawing a leaf in one line. <laughs> and so I've been trying to reproduce that in my work as just like a challenge to myself. 
Oh, God. I knew that today would be silly, but I still... I still didn't expect it. I don't know how. Oh, boy. Oh, yeah, you didn't know this was a 24-hour stream? Oh, is that what this is? Yeah. We gotta do... We gotta beat our, our current time. We gotta make it all I the feel way around. Like... I should I send feel you like my you... leaf so that out so we're we're racing on the same track. <laughs> They're turning this into those Mario Party games where you have to like go around the outside line. Those Mario Party games. Yeah. What about them? Or you have to go outside line. Yeah. You know, like there's an I there's a there's an object and you have to use your Mario Party game. Okay, I'm gonna go back to drawing my leaf. Oh let's look at those. Let's see how Az is doing. I have lines. It's a house. It is not a house. You got a peaked roof. It is You're gonna draw a little chimney? It's not it's not a house. You're telling me I should have turned symmetry on. Oh well I can do that. I mean you can turn symmetry that makes, on. That makes a lot of sense here. I'll just start. I'm doing I'm doing the symmetry tool on mine because it it's a very symmetrical plant. It's why I'm always so fascinated by it, because it's it's pretty much exactly the same on either side of it as it grows. Mine was way off. Yeah, I think. <laughs> oh, it's fine. I can move it. Yeah. There we go. <laughs> Do that again. Oh, but boy. Then, you know, you gotta just make incremental improvements. Honestly. Oh, Beowulf. The the dad puns. Oh, uh, can one of the mods boop him again? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we don't hate you. We're just a little disappointed. <laughs> oh, now the now the mods are on. Oh, the mods are oh. against you. Oh, so when when as has a problem. <laughs> wow. Because it's because they like me. All of my power slipping through my hands. It's such strong hands. <laughs> I'm switching to purple. Oh no. Purple. Yeah. Purple. Oops. Still too much in the white corner. There we go. So now we can see it. Yeah. Oh. Really pops the leaf, you know. Oh yeah. Yep. Pop pop. Pop pop. Oh. Remember when that show was relevant, kids? Community? Yeah. Oh. I was making a joke. What? 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 Who? I don't know. All right. Let's try these these spear leaves. And doop. And 
Do you? No. 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 I'm gonna have to do it again. Oh, you didn't center your center line well enough. Ah, I'll move it over here now. <laughs> do a different one. Okay, I'll get it this time. It's got like pointy and then we'll pointies, right? You couldn't have deleted the first one? Why? They've got different colors. Uh... Is this still my line layer? Oh, okay. I forgot to consider it was still your line layer. Yeah, are you even labeling your layers? I mean, I Corey, do, but... Corey, you know I don't... <laughs> name my layers that's for smart artists smartists smartists now i'm just wibbling with the symmetry tool okay this always the happens when i use the symmetry tool the symmetry tool is really fun especially when you add like maximum number of symmetry lines and you just make a weird oh. like <laughs> Yes, please send me bulk Excedrin. Not because of Corey, but just because I live with migraines. Glad it's not me. <laughs> oh, goodness. Wee. Woo. Did you ever play with kid picks? Kid picks. Yeah, they had a mirroring tool, too. I don't think that. I did. Unless I just don't remember. <laughs> it was such a bad time that you forgot. Uh, yeah, no, I don't think I ever played with this. Before I got a proper uh, drawing thing, I just used MS Paint. <laughs> Fair. Mostly just due to that being my only option <laughs> that I knew of, anyway. <laughs> I remember a long time ago... There was like a picture going around amongst my artist friends. And it was that, uh, it was the, the alignment chart from like, you know, like the Dungeons and Dragons alignment chart, but it was, uh, what type of artist you are. And it was all based off of the names that, or whether or not you rename your, <laughs> your layers and in what manner you rename them <laughs> so you're chaotic evil no chaotic evil was renaming all of your layers but you did it to just like a hand smash on the keyboard that's chaotic evil so true neutral <laughs> wherein you never touch it yes <laughs> What if I trace a leaf? Can I just drag stuff from I mean, photos? No one's gonna no one's gonna hate you for tracing leaves. What if I trace a million leaves? Yeah. That sounds like it would take you a long time. Oh dragging works. That's fun. All right, so now I've got a leaf that I can trace at least. Yes. Oh, 
Perfect. Huge. Ah! No! Go back! I didn't <laughs> keep the button down to keep it locked to uh, aspect ratio lock. <clears throat> oh, oh, okay. Yeah. I see what you're yeah, saying. Yeah, yeah. That's, that's worth screaming about. You know? Yeah! Definitely! Mm -hmm. Yeah. I've probably screamed over less, so honestly, I can't judge you. Wow, that's convenient for me. <laughs> All right. Start at the bottom. Oh, God. Why not start at the top? Fine. I'll start at the top. No, start at the bottom. Oh my god. I mean, honestly, how can you tell? I'm starting in the middle. <laughs> Good for you. I'm doing a terrible job. <laughs> you should have started at the bottom. Ah, I don't think it would have gotten better. <laughs> I need to make this bigger so I can see it. <sighs> I'm just going to continue. Like nothing ever happened. I'll keep the bad ones so I can tell if I'm getting better. Oh, is that your excuse for not getting rid of the layers underneath? How did you know? <laughs> Random guess. You know, part, part of getting better is, you know, actually taking a hard look at the stuff you did, you did wrong so that you can make changes in the future oh yeah see real art a guy reasons like if you're doing you're doing drills it's just about getting a bunch of them down and you know repetition yeah yeah definitely oh why am i still so bad at this You know, not drawing for like a month really improved my game here. Oh, I'm sure it definitely didn't have a negative effect on you nope. at all. You can definitely just put down the pen and then it'll all just come flooding back. It's like yeah. riding a bicycle. <clears throat> There's Which, definitely no. You know, if, if, if you've done and then you haven't ridden a bicycle for like 10 years and you get on a bicycle, it's a weird feeling. Yeah. Same with like rollerblading. I used to do a lot of rollerblading and then I got rollerblades many years later and then my parents laughed at me because I was really slow. Oh. It's like, I'm doing it. And they were like, you suck. And then I had to rollerblade in secret until I got better. That says a lot about a lot of things. Anyway, hi, El, hi. Venom gets me. Yeah. Well, at least somebody does. Yep. At least one person. 
in this entire chat. Yep. He was using a soda stream, and I don't. I'm not chat saying a dang thing. I didn't a, say a, a thing. My my microphone input to as is different from what goes to chat. So I didn't say a thing. Just I was gonna to your silently giggle, gratuitous fart noises. I didn't <laughs> It's, I mean, I knew it wasn't a fart, but I, it sounded like one. And I am a child. There's a lot of resonance <laughs> on it, isn't there? There really is. You see, Chad gets it. Oh, what you doing? What? What you doing? Nothing. You eating? Not when? Maybe. Oh, you know you don't have to secretly make new layers. You can, you can I did make new layers. I didn't. I didn't secretly make new layers. It was more that I was like, "Oh, hey, it would help if I drew on the other layer." Hmm. That's not secretly doing it. It's just realizing that you did do it. And then went, oops, didn't change layers. Don't be such a butt. Yeah, you! Pointing at yourself. Rude. I was just, you know, doing my job as host to inquire about your art process so that people at home could understand why your art suddenly turned gray. <laughs> Whereas mine... Is purple pink, and everyone knows why. Oh, do they? Yeah. Why is it pink, by the way? I like bright colors. Oh, see, I don't remember you saying that earlier. So I thought it was obvious. Who's who's the liar now, Corey? Who's lying at all? I don't know. You are apparently who's accusing anyone of lying. You. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the gloves are coming off. <laughs> but you need those for drawing. No. Well, I put it back on immediately, so. Oh, who's lying now, Corey? Why is it lying? <laughs> who's hiding things now, no. Corey? <laughs> no one. <laughs> and nothing. <sighs> Just trying to draw the bright spots in my leafies. Because they're shiny. These shiny leafies.
all look so cool when I'm done. Just like my my maple leaf. Sorry, I'm just really amused by the conversation that just happened in chat. I'm usually at work during this time on Monday chats. Is it always like this? <laughs> usually, yes. With As and Corey, always. <laughs> Boy. Yeah, it's kind of just tune in to hear us bicker for <laughs> three hours. I've literally described it as just you and I hanging out like we would normally do if we didn't have an audience, but we just happen to have an audience. <laughs> well, I mean, there's less Sea of Thieves going on. But yeah, I mean, that's the bickering true. Is the same. The bickering is the same. But it comes from love. Aww. Love and friendship. Friend. <laughs> Blove. Yes. <laughs> what is love? Love. Nope. Clearly, clearly not true love. Nope. Just love. What is to blame? You were playing cards together, and he cheated. He's saying we would have to fight over the Miracle Max role if we if we ever did a Princess Bride. Oh! No! 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 No, because I would want to be Maxime. Are you kidding me? It's Maxime, right? I think so. Am I remembering her name right? I think so! Makes sense that they would have the same name. See if I can get there before chat goes. Oh, Max and Valerie. Ew. Ew. No, it should be Maxine. We're, it should we're be changing, Maxine. We're changing the names of Princess Bride characters now. I did love her, though. She was great. Especially when she beats the shit out of him. It's like, how pretty, how pretty, how pretty. And he's like, ah, I my her. wife is so scary. <laughs> I know, exactly. That's why she's great. So how old were you when you learned that Humperdinck's a real name? Uh, when I watched that movie, I guess. What, you thought it was a real name from watching that movie? Not like a comedy name that they made up just to amuse you? I, I've heard worse. <laughs> worse? Well, like in terms of like fake fake names that are meant to be funny like i don't know hump there's worse things than humperdink i don't know if this is a road we want to walk down no but also again the name engelbert hum humperdink is really funny that's that's fair i will give you that i guess There's a NASCAR driver once who was named Dick Trickle. Yes. I mean, it's NASCAR, but... Yep. Just gotta, just gotta accept it and move on. Yeah, I wouldn't think about it too much. You might you <laughs> might break you might break something. <laughs> oh. Uh-huh. <laughs> so 
weird that you would assume that. Rude, even. Is it? Is it rude? Oh, so you're saying I can get a collectible plate. Oh no, I can get Dick Trickle's car. What is he sponsored by? Wow. Nineteen ninety-seven. Oh, so it's forever ago. Yeah, that's like back in the nineteen hundreds. Yeah, <laughs> way back in the nineteen hundreds. Nineteen diggity X. <laughs> Yeah, exactly. Forever ago. Literally. Forever. Yep, people are definitely going to be able to tell these are leaves when I'm done. Yeah. Yep. Definitely. People are going to look at this and be like, that's an identifiable plant. Yep. A real plant that you could own. Definitely a real live plant. It's very lively, like you could call it Blake Lively. No one would question that. Like, that's the oh. name of that plant. Is it a Blake? Is it kind of a... Susan? <laughs> Francesca. Yeah, I'm getting Francesca vibes. Yeah. Francesca. Name is Francesca Lively. Oh, jeez. Do you not name your art? Not. You just not in that manner, no. Leaf number one. Leaf number two, final. Wait, 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 wait. Are you. Are you naming all the leaves? Because there are multiple leaves on naming that plant. Naming the plant. Oh, Plancesca. <laughs> I'm just saying, you're talking about each individual leaf, and at that point, you're going to have... No, oh, the collective leaves are Plancesca. 20, 21? 21? You have 21 names to think of. Two, four... Six, eight, ten. How did you? Oh, no, it's 23. No. How did you count the number of leaves that fast? Uh, sometimes I'm good at math and sometimes I'm not. That's not math. <laughs> oh, well, then I'm good at the thing like that that isn't math. Okay. <laughs> I don't I'm know. Sure, you don't want to pull that out as like a party trick? Like that could be. I'm your good go -to. at I'm good at counting things that are in bunches. Yeah. Like scary good. This is like nothing. Well, I mean, I guess yeah. Anyway, I mean, when you have to try and do inventory at a store enough. Yes, I understand. No, you don't. You've never worked in a grocery store. That's true. You've never been scrambling with the inventory people walking up behind you at 11 o'clock at night waiting for to be able to count the section that you're just trying to work. And they're sitting there with their little their little hip calculator going clack, 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 clack
<laughs> you say they, they, they threatening they smell like at you. Oh yeah. And they smell like uh the inventory smell, people have smell a smell. Like, they smell like BO and cigarettes. <laughs> it's all like the weird people that you that you're like, wow, <gasps> you don't look like you go out in the daytime. The, are you they sure the you people. didn't work with cryptids? <laughs> I think maybe one of them might have been. Uh, uh, specifically, my company would hi hires out to a company that does literally nothing but inventory. So they go to people's stores and take inventory. That doesn't mean I didn't have to sit there and count a bunch of things to, you know, make the process faster and easier for them. But yeah, no, it would be a horde of people. Uh, on inventory night, they would come in they, like, around as, like as ten o'clock. Like, oh yeah, no, they literally like just all as one into the door. It's creepy. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna need like some horror drawings of this. Like this is a beautiful scene. <laughs> like there's franchise opportunities here. You you got like the old ladies who gave up being a school bus driver or like a. a like cafeteria oh, worker because they, you know, those people were are so tired angry. of dealing with. It was like that kind of stuff. No, retail is incredibly dehumanizing. That's why I left. Yeah, no, it's I uh, couldn't get a job in retail. That's you know, and, and, and as a university student with no retail experience, it was uh, oddly difficult to. Get a job at retail. I, that must I got be a Canada one interview. Thing. That sounds like a Canada thing. Because mm. here, the retail jobs are the ones who literally have no experience. At worst, you just start way less money than everybody else. Like I did. Huh. You just have to find the right store that's desperate enough for anybody. <laughs> so that's where you have to set up your cameras to catch these inventory workers. The elusive. The elusive back inventory. Room cryptids. Oh, yeah. See, that's why I, even though we had an inventory team come in, we would always have to make sure to actually count because there's good chance. And this is me quoting my bosses that they would mess something up and not notice or not care. And not care. Also that. Damn good at their jobs, though. My my goodness. The efficiency. It's terrifying. Hmm. Terrifying efficiency. Yes. Yes. Keep an eye out for these people. Well, you only ever see them at night. Keep an eye out. <laughs> Lock your doors. <laughs> the inventory into your are kitchen. Coming. Like you're 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 at home, your lights are out. You hear like your fridge door open and some clinking, and then like your pantry, you come out. All the all the cupboards are open, no one's there. Just the the smell of cigarettes and body odor. <laughs> you hear a distant clacking on a keyboard. Yeah.
<laughs> what? Oh, chat. This October, no one is safe from upper management. Wait, coming up to the end of my first pass at leaves. And Ooh, how are you will, feeling? We will take a break at that point when I'm done. How am I feeling? Yeah. Uh, my knee yeah. hurts? I meant about the drawing, but oh, okay. Uh, Do you want to talk about your knee instead? Well, it hurts sometimes. Oh, and how does that make you feel? In pain. And how does that make you feel? Like I should take something. <laughs> I don't know where this is going. I'm just going until you get annoyed with me. So about this far. <laughs> Yes, and then you release an evil cackle snort. At my expense. Yeah. we go basically it there we go yep damn Francesca you're looking fine boy look at that leafies it's just like nature did it yes Definitely. Yes. One hundred percent. All right, we're gonna take a break. Sit tight. We'll be roughly three to five minutes. So enjoy some ads. No as. No as is after the ads. Oh, that makes more sense. Welcome back, everybody, to Can't Draw Horses Club. Today, As and I are drawing leaps. And uh, actually, I'm uh, going to be eating this shawarma that just arrived. Ooh! So, look forward to that. And by forward, I mean, I'm just going to sit here on this screen and then uh, hide myself. Ta da! Whoops. <laughs> there we go. It all works now. Now no one can see me. Oh, no now it's all. just me. Mm. Me hope crinkling you're... my tinfoils. Hope you enjoy what you paid for, chat. <laughs> That's true. Yeah. Mm. You better... Actually, in fact, you better be enjoying what you paid for. Because if you're not...
can really savor this. Yeah! Crinkle that right into the mic. Oh, yeah. Mm. You yeah. love to hear it. Yeah. This is what the audience craves. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Oh, Molly, if you're going to pay ransom to get Corey back, you're going to have to pay more than that. Mm-hmm. Yep, so far we've only got 50 bits to get me back from the void. <laughs> People very interested in watching me uh, eat. I don't have a Venmo. <laughs> How have you not been bullied into getting a Venmo yet? Um... I think they had like some weirdness in Canada at the start, or like, oh, here. that would make sense. But also, we have uh, Indirac over email, so you can just oh, dealer choice. Does that mean that I can put that hundred towards leaving you off screen? Maybe. So then we're at negative fifty. Oh, oh, oh! Now we're at negative a hundred. I guess I I never come back. No, not not anymore. Okay, let's see if this actually works. Okay, so far so good. Good, excellent. We love to see it. Uh -huh. Hey, I did it. So you decided to make your leaves green. Why is that? Well, so that's just the base color. And then what happened? And then I add other colors on top of it. <laughs> Molly, if you can figure out a way for me to add horse bits to a leaf, you know I will draw it. Horse ear leaves. Yeah. I mean, a horse could just wear this as a hat. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you could have, like, a, a little cheeky hoof peeking out. Like, the horse is hiding, lurking beneath the shrubbery. See, my initial thought was a horse that has leaf, leaves for ears. Yep. Or is it just like, I mean, this would take forever to draw, so there's no way I would do it on a stream. But a horse that just is leaves. Right. Like, like it's walking around and you see, and you're like, oh, that's a green horse. And then you get closer and you realize that it's actually just made up of leaves. What if? Your plant is covered in tiny parasitic horses. Huh? <laughs> what? <laughs> like aphids, but horses. Woo!
this radish? Oh, that's beautiful. Now I want to draw a horseradish. Well, time to pop open Google. <laughs> to, you're going to Google just horseradish? What, to see if that's, if somebody's already done that? No. Just reference photos. Um, would a horseradish look like a horse rat? A horse. Would a horse radish look like horseradish, or would it look like a radish that is also a horse? Well, it's you drawing, so uh, it probably looks like that oddish you tried earlier. Hey, that was like two seconds. Really rad? No, it's rad-ish. Okay, it's like it. It's like rad-ish. So it like has a skateboard, and it tries to do a kickflip, and it can't quite. It, oh yeah, there we go. Maybe it could only do an ollie. It has a skateboard, but it can't actually ride it. Wait, so the horse just car carries it around? Or or does it have does it have a skateboard but then it also does like the button up with the pocket protector in it and the glasses that are broken in half and reconnected with tape what's what's wrong with pocket protectors <laughs> you would say that pens are always blowing up <laughs> You have protect your pockets. Uh, why are the pens in your pockets? You can carry a bag. Oh. Oh no, no. I'm I'm a wallet type person. Ooh, a, a radish riding a tiny horse. It's a horse that thinks it's into the music the kids like, but it's actually just like Nickelback. That's just describing uh, Gen X people. Oh. Slash millennials. Yeah. Nobody knows what, what uh, those Zoomers are into, music-wise. Uh... The joke answer is anything that's short enough to be a TikTok. <laughs> so they just like speed speed up the music track to fit fit in the TikTok link. Uh, sure. Well, so that happens sometimes. But then also sometimes it's just that the songwriters that are making music right now have a tendency to make their songs really, really short because they want to make sure that, like, the concentrated good parts are TikTokable. Why, why weren't they always doing that? Why? I don't know. Why not always make the good, good parts all, all together? Because... Long form music was the thing for a while, and now it's not. So long form music is dead. I'm not saying it's dead. It's just not the thing that's as popular with the younger generation. Oh. It's not that it's dead. It's that everything is an ever an art and, and any kind of Thing like that is always an ever-changing being that you have to either keep up with or get stuck behind and then cry about it like a baby on the internet about how you don't understand the kids these days. <laughs> oh boy, we're going deeper than I expected there. I'm just going to pull that back. Uh, uh keep my opinions for my own non-existent streaming. <laughs>
I'm almost done eating. I was in, I was saying okay. it. I'm sure. Yeah, I was. You, it's not that you were enjoying watching me flounder or anything. I'm no, sure. not at all. Yeah, right. Okay, so like when radio became a thing, songs became more radio friendly, and now and by having like specific sets, and they were all usually roughly around the same length, and now now they're shorter. I don't know. You'll always find somebody to hate something else. Joys of human beings. Wow. No matter what you feel or like or choose to do, someone will out there will always think that you're making the wrong decision and ruining whatever you're contributing to. I mean, that's definitely what they say about me. What you could you ruining everything that you contribute to? I would never say that. Because you're the only reason I'm here. <laughs> I mean, it's hard to be on my stream if I'm not here. Oh, see? Amelie likes your purple leaves. You have one fan. It's fun when I'm, uh, this, this comes up a lot when I'm podcasting, because the co-host is just like, thank you to our one fan, one person who listens to, to the show, when everyone involved is, is like having their friends and partners listen to the, the show. So we know that there's like four people who listen to our podcast. Yep. I mean, I still post my art even um in, on places even though I get like five likes. Can't you can't make you can't do the thing you like to do for the clicks. Gonna get you nowhere. Well, there's your problem. I'm using You're trying to get the clicks. <laughs> you gotta you gotta ditch those clicks. That's your problem right there. Yep. Mm -hmm. Carburetor's full. Yep. Mm -hmm. Camshaft twisted. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Need a new gasket. Mm. 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 Oh, I could definitely Timing use a new belt gasket. Slipped. Mm. 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 Are you making up words now? <laughs> Spark plug. Okay, that one I know is real. Flywheel. Real, but it's not on a car. Eh? Eh? O-ring? We don't talk about that on polite, impolite company. Piston. <laughs> I know that one's real. Gas squirter. Again, like company. <laughs> there are children present. Exhaust manifold. <laughs> uh, sure. Yeah, that's probably real. I've heard of both of those words. Just a bunk. <laughs> I mean, hmm, <laughs> hmm. Mm. 
<laughs> yep, wankle rotary Ooh. engine. Always good. Everyone loves a good wanker. Oh, God. I'm trying to remember what the name of the... Oh, Sway Bar. There we go. Sway Bar. Huh? That just sounds like a wrestling move. Uh, split differential. That also sounds like a wrestling move. Oh, but not healthy. Like, that, that no. A lot of spinal damage. Yeah, no, that one's not good. It's, it's, human beings shouldn't have a split diff. No. Like, Jack what? Hall. That's what I call my brothers. No? No. Okay. That's what I call you. But Why? I don't know. <laughs> oh. Got any more in the old tank there? Well, I'm trying to think of bits that uh, are less common. Like, you know what a radiator is. Yeah, I've, I've had one try to break on me before. Yeah, so it's not it's not fun for the game. Uh, no. Carburetor, fuel injection, idler arm. That's like um, the, the the idler wheel. <laughs> it's no, it's the um, it's the arm movement that you make outside your window as you're waiting t for the traffic to finally get going, and you're just like, "Wee, I'm bored." That's the idler arm. Yeah, the one that you put out and it goes, "Woo!" Yeah, yeah. yeah. I already did <laughs> camshaft. That was like yeah. one of the first things I went for. Love a camshaft. Nope, never mind. Not gonna say it. No, what? No, nothing. I didn't say anything. I didn't say a thing. I didn't say a thing. Not a thing. Yep. Safe. Did it. Yeah, do the springs on the bucking arms have any fun names? Like I feel like they do. Such a pain in the ass to take part. Does that have something to do with British people? Yep. Everything does. They would like to think so. If you ever want to feel better about British people, just watch a cooking channel from a British push person on YouTube. And then what? And then marvel in how they think uh, tortillas is an ethnic food. I don't think... I'm making jokes here. I don't think corn's local to the British Isles, so... No, I know, I know, I know. Okay, this is it. This is... This is partially an inside joke with me and my and, and my partner PJ. Uh, so we watch we watch sorted food uh, on YouTube, which is uh, this group of British guys, and they're funny and they're great and they're very good chefs. I am not discouraging like disparaging their work at all. They are wonderful. However, anytime they start looking at something that's outside of like like their you their their little you know, their little island of info. It's just fascinating to watch them be utterly confused by things that, to me, somebody who grew up all over the U.S. is, like, common knowledge. Like, one time they were doing a... They were doing an episode on, like, cool uh, uh, kitchen utensils that you can use to make food. And it was, like, things like slicers or you know, varying, you know, like, like gadgety type things. And then suddenly out of nowhere, a tortilla press. 
And I was like, that's not a new invention for the kitchen. That's existed since like ancient times. <laughs> It's just, it's really humbling to watch them see something as Marvel. It's like being like, I'm marveling at something that I'm just like, that just exists. Look, look. Tortilla press is that thing where you have two pans and then you just squish up tortilla <laughs> in them, right? I mean, I guess, yeah, technically you could kind of look at it like that. It looks like two frying pans. They're on a hinge. Yeah. The really good ones, though, have a threefold method where you put it down and then you press it opposite direction. Mm. Oh, another car thing. Yes, Death Like Cats. Bushings. Gotta, <sighs> gotta keep, keep the rust off your bushings. It's like a plant thing, too. Oh. Yeah, no, I'm drawing a bushing. See? It's right here. My screen. Mm. Yeah, it's more of only a part of a bushing. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> yes, you're not wrong. It is almost a waffle iron. Except for you don't cook it in it. You press it. To flatten it. And then you take it out. And then you cook it. I'm allowed to make fun of British people. My ancestors came from there. <laughs> Is that the rule? Yeah. It's the joke it's the joke at the rule. It's the joke it's the joke at the rule that people make that's a bad a bad rule. <laughs> Tortilla presses are good for letting out aggression. You just like Argh! I mean, yeah. Full body weight. It's the it's the same reason why kneading dough can sometimes be really great for aggression. It just requires a lot of like arm strength and it's as close as you could get to like punching something. Or you can without just have punching. a dough hook, you know. But that's not as fun. I like it. It is a lot I like faster. To sit there. I mean, and I get you to know, watch it happen instead of me doing it. Okay, so like, listen. <laughs> Don't get me wrong. I've used a dough hook before, but have you ever actually kneaded like dough yourself from scratch? Especially like a really glutinous dough. Have you ever gone through that process? Really glutinous. Mm. It kills the arms, but it feels so good. Who needs a punching bag when you can make bread? And then... <laughs> Every time I make bread, I forget how long it takes to proof. And then uh, I have to stay up till like 3 a.m. Because that's when the bread's ready to go. That sounds like the, the, the baking sleepover nights I've done with my friends. <laughs> baking sleepovers yeah go we a, a couple of us go over to one of their houses and we all bake together all day and and then the next day after we've stayed up really late and been goofy and giggly together we get to eat our our uh makings for breakfast <laughs> you're, you're making Spence. Yeah, your makings. The, the makings you did. All the makings. Yes! 
Why are you saying this like it's not normal? Well. It's the first Indus time I've heard of it. Industrial bread baking is a graveyard shift. Yes. Uh, mine was from 11 p.m. to 7 a.m. I think. Yeah, that sounds correct. Gotta get your bread in at like five. Well, there's always those people who are there the second the store opens. And they're like, where are my bagels? Oh, did you make bagels? I made, well, I made bread and I made bagels and I made donuts. Same thing. I worked, I worked, I worked at the uh, bakery department in the Safeway. Ooh. And I was the... I was the I was the sole overnighter, except for my weekends. The weekends were an old lady. <laughs> Just comes like in the start of a poem, and, like... <laughs> and the weekends were an old lady. <laughs> yep, that tracks. Okay, but who is who who is the weekends were an old lady the album of uh, the weekend. But I thought the weekends were an old lady is the full name of so that they they put their band name in the album but like for TikTok. <laughs> Uh. There we go. So, what exactly have you been drawing an engine instead of leaves? I was going to put my leaves on top of it. Look at this. Look at this beautiful... <laughs> It would help if it was actually on there. top of. No, it's perfect. I've done it. Well, how scenic. <laughs> oh, nature and machine together. Wow. 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 I can just, uh. She's beautiful. Ah, whoa. So this is an abandoned car in engine? Is no, that this is uh, like a, a centerpiece for a wedding. Wow, that is a weird wedding. You're, you're a weird wedding. Look, I'm just saying it's got some weird heteronormative vibes. What? 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 I didn't say anything. How? You've never seen... Oh, right, you're in Canada. What do you mean? Look, just... <laughs> what am I missing? It's it's just got some Southern f flair, okay? It's just got some, like, Southern America flair to it. All right, that's, all, uh, that's, that's all I'm saying. I'm not saying anything else.
I'm trying to lay out here. Make it pretty. Some of some of the leaps definitely have to go underneath the engine. And then I definitely have to like Well, I mean that would give it some good depth, but you'll have to fill in the I hate my engine. But that might be a good idea. Yeah. I'm just gonna get a big, big old brush. Oh. Get in there. Yeah. 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 Oh. Hard steel. Where's my magic wand? Does Krita have a magic wand? It must. Yep, there it is. Found it! Doop! I can just merge these. And now I've got an uh, engine that has stuff. Like a wow! Dream. It's beautiful. Nature. <laughs> Nature! Nature is healing! Whoa. I can still see leaves. Yeah, you're supposed to. No, I meant like the behind, right there. Yeah, they're behind it, yeah. Yeah, no, but you can see there's like yeah, you can see them. Uh, never mind. I don't know why I'm bothering. There, I fixed it. No, you. Do. I mean, I guess it is kind of better. <laughs> nope. 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 <laughs> Somehow what? <laughs> Oh, yeah. The wedding is in a barn with decorated old machines. And they've got, like, those those tractor seat stools. You know the ones. The ones that look like tractor seats? They are tractor seats that have been converted into stools. Oh, of course. Of course. Yeah. You know, just refurbish. I usually see those in, like, country bars. Yeah, everyone at the wedding has a cowboy hat on. Uh, it's required. Are you kidding me? I mean, you gotta dress nice. Yeah. Uh, long blue jeans, no shorts. Yeah. Button up t-shirt. If you have one. If you don't, at least make it a polo. Okay, Kevin? Closed show, toed shoes, because it's, it's still a work site. You're less likely to hit open-toed shoes in the South. At a wedding? Yeah. Well, I mean, for men, they're most likely wearing cowboy boots. Why would the wedding only be men? I, I'm, well... Like, I... Okay, so you're requiring... I mean, women. it can be a gay wedding. Wait, can you you're get requiring... gay in Texas? Is it, like, countrywide? I don't... In the States? Or is it... Well... Her state. I mean, I don't know how your, your can you your law works. Probably. Will it be easy? No. <laughs> okay, Lord Haas, your your mission is to mock up what open toed cowboy boots look like. I'm not gonna Google for feet picks uh to 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 help with your your paint. What if? No, never mind. <laughs> I was gonna say, what if I drew them? But then I realized I don't hate myself enough. <laughs> That's why we, we're, we're passing this off to Hosk. Smart. Much smarter. This is why you get paid the big bucks. Cowboy Crocs. 
Because they make, I... uh, Crocs makes, like, dress shoes. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, but, and f- uh... Like a full boot, but with the big holes in it. That would be lovely. Can you imagine, like, the foam croc material going up your calf? Like, Oh, that sounds awful. Just intersecting with your, like, flesh below your knee somewhere. Like, that sounds this? like you would get so sweaty. Yeah. Like, you go to take them off, and it's just like... Just I'm not moving! <laughs> yeah, it would just, like, vacuum seal to your foot. Oh, man, can you imagine the boot feet stench? It's beautiful. Kind of sounds like moon boots. This sounds nothing like moon boots. Unless moon boots are a different thing where you're from. I was going to say, what are, to me, moon boots are those ones that you, that you could see as a kid and they have like the, the ones you would break the, your like, leg using. Yeah. Yeah. And they have like that, like weird, like rubber con like cave thing that you would go boing, 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 boing. Just like that. Yeah. But obviously like that because. Huh. Anyway. Puffy boots. Okay. I mean, I can Google. Moon boots. Oh. They're kind of like Uggs, but... Ugh. Blockier. Oh. Uh. I don't like those. Oh, it's like a, a five-year-old's drawing of a shoe. Like, Wait, hold on. Yeah. What is this? The moon boots? Yeah, they're like Uggs. They look like soft snowboard boots. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Moon shoes. Well, there's the ones that look like they're made of two trash bag containers. <laughs> by the time by the time I ran across moon shoes, I was too heavy for them. It sucked. There was no 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 spring in my step. Yeah, no, those don't uh, support much much weight at all. <laughs> yeah. No, Tamily's got a link to basically what I was picturing for Cowboy Crocs. Ooh, yeah. No, that's, that's about spot on, honestly. I like that they thought to include the holes all the way up so that you could have more space for decorating. <laughs> Because, you know, those, what are they called? Giblets? Giblets? That's a food thing. Or just body chunks. I don't think you're talking about body chunks. Wait, what is a body chunk? A giblet. What? Yes. Are you talking about the food thing? No. I'm so confused. Hold on. <laughs> Thinking about grommets? Is that the word you're going for? Oh, is that what it's... I thought you grommets... Are circular holes? Grom- grommets, grommets are, are the hole that have the metal around them. Yeah, pretty much. Or just basically... I'm talking about... Hole. I'm talking about the speci- specifically the weird name that Crocs calls their, their, their decorations. I'm gonna look this up. Crock decorations. Because I know that there's a weird. Just, they, I told you it was they a weird have thing. shoe charms. 
Oh, it's the things you plug into the holes. Oh my god. Customize your Crocs. Oh, yeah, okay. Oh yeah. Yeah. No, um giblets or gibs are like what we call like the exploded body parts in video games. Oh, which are all see, it's a food thing. Yes, but that I call that giblets though. Yeah. To each their own. What do you call I mean, the, the Tetris shapes? Tetris shapes? Tetronimos? Yeah. Tetron Tetronimo? I don't know. Is it like Geronimo but Tetronimo? <laughs> or is it some other ending to the word? No, there's there's just you know, some people call them Tetra. like tetrads. Ew. Right? Like there's a correct name. And then there's weird Weird names that don't fit. Much like giblets versus gibbets. I... Just saying. That's how I say it. I'm just sitting here looking at my beautiful art. Okay, look, I will g I'm going to give Crocs one thing though. They make the best flip-flops I've ever owned. I don't like flip-flops. Well, I do. I always feel like they're about if to come you like, off. If you like flip-flops, Crocs makes the best flip-flops ever. I I need I need like the thing to be completely strapped to my foot. I need my foot to be in an enclosed space. It needs to, like <laughs> roll bars in for my feet. Enclosed space. If I'm gonna be putting my foot in prison, oh. I might as well be a secure facility. Oh, good. Oh, here we go. Thank you, Hosk. Yep, that's it. <laughs> Beautiful. You really, you really came through there for us. You know, Death Life's Cats has a point. It sounds like the classic Crocs are actually your perfect shoe. Yeah, if they have like a heel thing, though. So it's not just... But they have them. Into a thing. Yeah, I need the... the they like, have the thing. I, I need like the, the roller coaster ride bar <laughs> for my foot. Roller <laughs> ride bar? Yeah. <laughs> Oh, no. Okay, I kind of legitimately actually like how this came out. If I'm being honest, I might end up embroidering this. <laughs> uh-huh. It looks like it would make a good embroidery. Perhaps. Am I wrong? No. But it's more of a, of course you would embroider this. That's what these reference photos are all for. I mean, duh, but we don't have to tell them that. Oh. I just have to. Next episode is not embroidery. I I don't have the right cameras set up in that I only have one camera to be able to show off my embroidery. I've actually got um, Angel on next week and we haven't discussed what to do. Well, we, that we kind of have, but also. there's like five different ideas. Gonna have to set up like a bonus stream at some point to just get a bunch of people together to paint nails. Oh, those the oh. sandals you like? No, 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 no. Uh, Square Dot Cube said that it would be great if Croc made gladiator sandals. Those ones are sold out. But fun fact, they have <laughs> they have made gladiator sandals. 
What hasn't Crocs made? A lot. Uh, honestly? I couldn't tell you. Like, I need a full body Croc. I bet they haven't done that. I don't want to think about a full body Croc. That just sounds wrong somehow. It's like a morph suit by a croc. No. And the holes on the face only kinda line up with where your eyes would go? No. <laughs> I don't like this. <laughs> it's like you get <laughs> a person made of Swiss cheese, sort of. Oh, okay. This is awful. <laughs> now, let's see. Does Krita have, like, people models? I gotta get, like, a, a reference model of a dude. Let me... Well, new. Sure. Tall like a man. Yes. T pose. Sure. I don't need a picture of Mario T posing. Sure. I'll grab this picture of Putin T posing. Oh boy. Could not. Ah! Uh, That's what you get. Web. Just need like a, a human body. Oh. There we go. And then new layer. Crocs are like a off yellow gray, right? Yeah. That's sure. What they are. See, whenever I think of Crocs, I usually think of vibrant orange, but. That's because of a person and not because of the Crocs. Probably didn't even need this person. So, explain to me why you're drawing a T-posing human, exactly? Oh, I'm drawing my full body Croc. Oh, good. We've gone here with this today. Excellent. Yeah, gotta put the holes in. Yeah, can't go without the holes. You know what they say. The more holes, the better. Chat, I don't, unfortunately, I don't think we're going to get her to go to a break while she's doing this monstrosity. So, I think we just have to live with it. It's just going to be like a minute. When, I mean, I could walk away and not have to experience one, it, so I minute. suppose you I mean, could too. Okay. Let me just hear, I'll, I'll fill the hole. <laughs> Come on, fill. There we go. Okay, all right. So it's kind of like this. It just looks like you've taken one of those shooting range things. It's like, this is where you hit every the person. But it's to help you got a couple of headshots in, at least. in the conceptualization. Can I, can I ask why on the face there is a hole, what I can only assume is here, here. I told you they don't match here? up with the eyes. 
That's not matching up with the eyes. That's not matching up with anything. Don't you think that would be fun? This is a crime scene. <laughs> Corey has killed the entirety of this stream. Well, it was nice seeing everybody. See you later. Ah. I mean, I guess I could just cut holes in it and then reveal the man underneath. What if what if it was a clear plastic so that there are holes, but at least the person can see through it? And I guess it would de defeat the purpose. That sounds of weird. I don't I don't know if I understand what you're talking about. You probably have to draw it. <laughs> no, you've already tried it for me. Just bring the layer of the dude back. <laughs> no, I gotta get the eraser out. <laughs> And then I can erase the holes. And then now it definitely. Now it definitely looks like it's just one of those shooting range persons. Holes. Oh, yeah. yeah, it's great. Yeah. Oh, good. Oh, yes, excellent, wonderful. We love it. Yeah. Oh boy. Oh. This is the best way to do this. There's like kind of like an outline. Corey. <laughs> oh, oh, hello. I got <laughs> oh. <ice cream. laughs> oh, that's what you were happy about. Oh, okay. Well, it's break time. It, it's cinnamon roll or it's pumpkin pie, and this is the oven. Do you know which is which? Nope, not anymore. Okay, cool. Couldn't keep track of them when I was driving. <laughs> Wait, were you driving with them in your hands? No, but for the purposes of this joke, yes. <laughs> wow, you two in your car. <laughs> Anyways, we'll be back in like three minutes. Hello again, everybody. We're back. As and I are drawing leaves today on Can't Draw Horses Club, or as is eating ice cream of unknown flavor, and I'm drawing a man wearing a full body croc. A uh, pumpkin. It's pumpkin. Okay. Initially, I had cinnamon, but then I traded. Oh, good choice. I'll just continue carbon coals in this uh, outfit. Yeah, no, please continue to ruin. So you get a good idea of like how breathable and squeaky the outfit would be. No, oh, awful. Probably need. I like, will say some elbow and knee creases, or creases yeah. around where a lot of movement happens. I feel like you need to show some like sweat, like kind of just. Pouring out of the holes. It's... Oh, okay. Wait. What if I just draw like a, a a puddle on the ground? What if there's just like then I guess dripping. We can sell this as no a way no 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 there's no end to that sentence no drop some water weight no. and water your lawns at the same time it's part of like a water conservation thing so you're not like using your drinking water on, on your I lawn hate it. or like Thanks, your, your almond it. crops uh and instead, you just stand out in the sun in your croc and <laughs> lose weight. Why? Sweat has electrolytes like plants crave. That movie proved that that wasn't true. <laughs> 
But <laughs> everything on TV is true. <laughs> Advertising wouldn't lie to me. They can't legally lie to me. Corey. 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 Why? So I shouldn't take this on like Shark Tank or Dragon's Den or whatever. Or oh, directly no, to the no. Croc Corporation. Please, please do that. And please make sure that it's recorded. You know, I bet the Croc Corporation has already tried this. They just have, like, a prototype somewhere. And they were just like, well, it's probably too expensive for the consumer level. Like, this is a specialty product. So maybe only wealthy people have yeah. access to this. Specialty. Yeah. Yeah, I can see this going well in Raptor Aquarium, but they don't actually have money. And this would be a for money thing. Do I want to ask? Never mind. Nope, I don't. What's Raptor Aquarium? I hear you're thinking out loud. Well, in the I didn't say that. Stream called Loading Ready Live. We, we have, like, an improvised bit we haven't done for several years. Oh, right. I forgot about that. Raptor Aquarium. Yes. Hmm. Jessica Engel asks, Corey, why are you trying so hard to do a horrible capitalism? Well, you see, the system is broken, so there's really no reason to, you know, reinforce the status quo. You've got to really think outside the box, blue sky, keep your eye on the prize, you make those dollars. Dollar, dollar bills, y'all. Or we could look at what Az is doing. What? No. Is that a butt? Yeah. What? No! This is a butt. It's uh, not um, gas squirting, so I can't tell. I can't oh, tell. sorry. Hold on. Hold on. Let me just... Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> what is it saying? Aww. <laughs> Hello to you too. <laughs> Aww. <laughs> so adorable. <laughs> what a nice butt. <laughs> Uh, you came back to us! <laughs> I'm just gonna make that go away. Uh. I mean, I'd love to see your take on the full body croc. Are you serious? If you've got Do time. Do you really? I mean, really, they're not really? too busy with the butt. I was- I was not drawing a butt! But then you did. I- Cause you were being weird! And I decided to match your energy. There's your first mistake. <laughs> okay, so hold on. So I feel like- You'd probably have at least a little bit of head poking out, right? What, you mean like just the top of the head? Like the... Yeah, you know, just like a little bit of... Some... Kind of like how your ankle sticks out of a normal croc. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <gasps> the 
Emily, that's fantastic. Uh, still trying to get over this reductus, reductress headline I saw. I farted so hard I was able to let go of my worthless dreams. And that's just... That just sounds like a good time. Yeah. Just get all the bad energy out. <laughs> Do a real cleanse. Oh, little action pose. You can tell that the human can still move. A little. I wonder if I can like gradient this so that it's cooler looking. Ah, uh, yes. I wonder if we've got like the color dodge tool. What is that? Do you even know what that is? You you are. What am I? <laughs> yeah, you sure got me. Yep. One hundred percent. Like, I'm not going to neglect my own work while you're doing stuff. I suppose fair is fair. Every single time, always forget to leave space for the feet. You could just remove them. Is it no! Oh. Yes, okay. You can keep them then. Oh, and it would have a commercial, and the music would be gonna make you sweat. Mm. Yeah, I'm 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 pretty much ready to call this finished. Yeah. Yeah, it's beautiful. Oh no, I've got a lot more headroom than I thought I did. Space to draw more stuff. Oh yeah, I gotta gotta make sure to include everything. Yep. Like the sun. 
Uh, well, I guess it is. They are sweating for a reason. Yeah. So gotta really emphasize like cause and effect for the audience. Hmm. Yes. More blue. Good. Okay. Now I'm done. Here's his freckles. Those are the holes! Looks a lot like, like the bomb disposal armor. <laughs> This is like Honestly? zero dark thirty, but or whatever the hurt locker. The hurt locker is the one with the the bomb disposal. There, oh, I don't yeah, know. Death likes cats just popped our hurt locker. Got a new sponsor. <laughs> I'm sorry. I don't know. I always forget whether or not Hurt Locker is a movie about a dangerous thing or a about sports. It has the word locker in it. I just like I my brain always like, oh, it's probably a football movie. <laughs> like, you know, definitely a football movie about like brain injuries and dealing with and coping with like extreme pressure in in like college sports and and you just shove all your feelings in the locker. And that saves the team. Yeah. They make like a grief diary or something or like a, a pain doll, but it's a locker. And then they set it on fire and burn down the school. That sounds like a good movie, honestly. It's like Ted Lasso, but dark. Dark. <laughs> All right. There you go. There's my doing. take. Uh, sorry, I'm distracted looking at. Oh. Hosk has uh, adapted it already. Very, very quickly. Yes. <laughs> Beautiful. Are you going to make it orange? I may as well. You may as well. An homage. To your favorite to Crocs. A chef that I don't remember if he ended up being a not good person or not. Woohoo! The the orange chef? I I haven't heard of him for years. Orange the orange croc chef. If you know, you know. Okay, cool. I thought he came out. It, it came out that he was a garbage dude. I still can't not think of him when I think of Crocs, though. That's right. Oh. Never tr trust uh, cis white men, kids. They'll always disappoint you. 
specifically famous ones. But now we have this. This yeah. is our new mascot for Can't Draw Horses Club. Crocky. Is, uh... <laughs> the walkie talking croc. There could be a horse in there. There could not be a horse in there. You don't know. Oh, man. Imagine if it was a horse covered in a croc. Now we need... Now you, now you need to draw a horse yeah. inside of a full-body croc. Someone's got to draw... Like, if horses wore croc. I, I, oh, if horses wore crocs? Well, a full body croc, but, I mean, if they just had, like, oh. horse crocs. The... So, wait, would that just make it that they're basically wearing horseshoes made out of rubber? Yeah, they nail the rubber to the horse's feet. Yeah. That sounds like it wouldn't work very long. <laughs> Oh. No, they actually have like little plastic shoes that clip on to, to horses' feet for like roads and stuff, but uh But those aren't those that's aren't not what yeah. We're no, I want either. I want a croc with like a little little heel strap. Yeah. Oh, and then croc barning. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The whole the whole <laughs> the whole situation is croc. Even the saddle. <laughs> Just that smooth, squishy foam. <laughs> oh, that poor horse. <laughs> I think the stirrups would have to be like a hard plastic, but rock horse armor. Yeah. Okay, Hosk, I, I don't care if there's a real foam shoe. I want them to be <laughs> croc branded and to look like crocs. Well, little for horses or like dog crocs. There. It's letting out a, a croc toot. So it's not the man inside? Oh no, it's the croc. It's croc. It's the croc that's burning. It's off gas and crocs. Mm hmm. Off, off gas and crocs. You gotta off gas your croc. Is that not what they say? A croot. <laughs> Okay, now we need like a summer version with like cutoffs. Wait, where are they cut off? Mid thigh. And then they're wearing normal Crocs. No! Down below. I quit. <laughs> Short sleeve Croc suit. No. 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 What do you mean the fart wouldn't escape no. the suit? The suit's full of holes. <laughs> Croc top. It's like a mesh shirt, but it's a croc. <laughs> it would probably be pretty, uh... Like, you know how, like, every once in a while those, like, down-filled vests make a comeback? Yeah. Like the puffy? <laughs> Stream was supposed to be about drawing fleas. Who? What? 
hockey? I don't remember. It being... No, not that kind of leap. Okay. Plants. Then our crux. Why? De decorative crock plants for your home. You? No. A pot. A, a plant pot. That is a crock. Why? The water wouldn't be able to stay in the pool. In the. Some plants don't the... like a lot of water. That's all the time I've got for. <laughs> Avocados are alligator pears, kind of the right zip code. But now I'm thinking about crocodiles. Like you know the mesh that they put like apple pears in. Yeah, yeah. But croc. And only for avocados. <sighs> Honestly, they could probably use those. You know what they use to c protect avocados from each other? More cardboard. <laughs> croc plants are a thing? What? Oh, no. Oh. Crock oh. Planters. Yeah. Planter. Yeah. I mean... I wanted a crock plant. You've disappointed like Corey for the last tree, time. A rubber tree or... <laughs> mm. Yes. Crockery. Okay. Corey, hi. Don't. I need you to do. I need you to do me a favor, okay? I need you to not freak out because my drawing is about to get slightly lighter, okay? I just need you to okay, but, not panic. But why though? But you did. You just. So I make a new player to to draw on that instead, and then I make this lighter. So I know which layer is my face drawing layer. Okay. So now All right. I'm drawing. But your line was already good looking. Oh my god! Oh boy. Uh, this might be Lord Haas, this might be stop freaking out. For the Lord Haas, stop freaking out. You need to calm down, Lord Haas. Stop. Okay, I'm gonna go back to Crocs, and Jessica Engel says, Google says, a crocodile fern, which means Crocs spread by spores. So if you see little lumpy bumps on Crocs, those are, are no. spores, and you, you, you no. dry them out, and you can collect them on, like, paper. No. And they're, like, really tiny. So, are you talking about propagating a crocodile? Yes. Croc well, this croc is croc predation. <laughs> Crocodation. Oh, the gibbets are the spores. <gasps> we figured it out. The we figured out the life cycle of the croc. <laughs> Bury a gibbet and you can get a croc plant. Be careful, though, if you ever swallow one of those, you will grow crocs inside your tummy. Then the croc this is stays a... in, your, in your digestive system for the rest of your life, or seven years. This is a proven medical fact. And you can trust me, because I'm a doctor. You heard it here first, folks, as is a doctor. Oh, 
Oh boy. No, it was just the idea of like a croc placenta. It was. Oh no! <laughs> Why did you have to say it out loud? <laughs> yeah. It's. It, it, I can't just laugh at things that are said in chat and then not. It's for the that YouTube. one you could have. That YouTube one you could have. Can't read you could have. You could have laughed and then just walked away. You could have just walked away. But no. <laughs> <laughs> That's really funny. <laughs> oh god. Uh... <laughs> Thinking about saying the croc essie, and now you went there for me. Thank you, Death <laughs> Life Cat. <laughs> I love that this is happening, and meanwhile, I'm just innocently trying to leap over here. Nothing to see here. <laughs> Jokes on you, chat. You can't get rid of us unless we want to go. I'm actually thinking this might be a good time to put the stream to bed. What? No! We're having fun. But I gotta go get ice cream. I guess. <laughs> Plus, if this keeps going, we'll be cancelled in like 20 minutes. Oh, yeah, that's true. Who knows? Dad might show up and take us down. I don't know who Dad is in this situation. Maybe Ian. I I don't want that. No, that's true. Oh. But what if everything was made out of Croc stuff? And what if not? It's like, it, have you seen everything everywhere all at once? And then, like, go to, like, the yarn or the the painting planet. Uh, but Crocs. No. Croc Why? It's like the metaverse, but... That sounds like it would be a really expensive... Uh... I mean, Meta's probably looking for people to advertise some way. So... Wait, so you're proposing there to be, like, an entire meta server I'm where... I'm just saying users could buy croc skins for their avatars. You know, maybe you're right. Maybe you should take this. <laughs> All right, well... Thank you, everybody, for joining us here. If you want to check We're out more of Az's stuff, uh, as is Ezra Lorne on Twitter and has Ezra Lorne Art on Instagram, I believe. Yeah, it's Ezra Lorne underscore art. If you want to check out their embroidery. I'm Corey. Thank you all for watching. And now I'm to sorry. thank the subs and I'm all of the bits. Thank you to Pulse Trevo for 96 months. I think this is the only show I've not subbed on, so get subbed on. We appreciate Thank it. Thank you. One Azralorn has subscribed for 79 months says, I ain't no narc. Oh, they sound reason. like a fun person to hang out Sounds with. Sounds like a totally different conversation was happening way back then. Yeah. RF 400, 71 months. Thank you. Uh, Molly cheered 50 bits to pay my ransom. And then Lurker Spine and Beowulf uh, countered that with 150 bits total. Maybe because we very briefly, very briefly banned Beowulf from the chat. Uh, then Death Likes Cats has been here for 28 months. Tortilla presses are great for letting out aggression. Again, a very different conversation was happening once upon a time. This dream does kind of get a little off the rails sometimes. I don't, I don't I, I just I'm just streaming my my uh art process like the the Yeah, me too. It's like going from beginner to 
becoming a more advanced drawer of things. Okay. Sure. We can say that. Okay. Well, uh, coming up, we have ice cream. So I already had ice cream. So those of you who don't have your own ice cream can can join the Living Ready Run crew at 6 p.m. Pacific time for a uh, remote stream outdoors live in the sunshine until the sun I'm going to get ice cream again. Uh, I'm going to get ice cream again just to spite you. Come hang out. See you all next week. Except for you, as You're not coming back. Bye! Yes.